Zach's Rank Buys, stocks with a short-term buy or strong buy recommendation. And now, here are more Zach's Rank Buys. Time to talk about a couple of more value stock picks now with Tracy Reinick, our value stock strategist here at Zacks.com. And we've got uh, some that are uh, in the commodities space here, yep. drifting back to your old My favorite. stomping grounds. <laughs> Tech Resources Limited, TCK, the ticker symbol, they mine a few different things. Yeah, copper, coal, a whole bunch of specialty metals, zinc. They're the third largest uh, producer of zinc in the world. Mm -hmm. um, they also have a little bit of play in the oil sands. So they're kind of in every hot commodity right now, yeah. other than the gold and the silver. Right. Um, so yeah, I mean, this kind of company is doing real well here. It was it was really rough in 2009. I saw the commodity prices came crashing down. Um, but everything's been rebounding. The um, last quarter was a record quarter for them in revenue. And um, they reinstituted the dividend in about seven or eight months ago now, I think it is. And then they raised it 50% in November. That. Yeah. yeah, that's because the cash flow is really starting to come in now. Now, I was surprised in their third quarter, they are big copper and coal. And I thought copper would have been the thing that really would have boosted them because the copper prices are really rising. But copper was just only so-so for them because they actually saw volumes down a little bit on their copper production. Okay. But coal and zinc were really hot. And they saw a big increase year over year in those two sectors, which is what fueled the record um, for last quarter. So in the estimates, uh, they didn't give any guidance, but the analysts are really being bullish here. This year, you know, they've they've raised a little bit for 2010, and they're going to report on February 8th. So we'll see in a couple of weeks what's going on with this last year. But with copper prices and coal prices also at like two-year highs, um, you can really see that 2011, they're seeing a big increase in earnings estimates here. Um, that's really pushing up the, the share price here. It's at two-year highs. It keeps, you know, wanting to go a little bit higher here. Um, but it's trading only about 12 times because these estimates keep rising. So. Dividends are coming back. Yes. And because companies are sitting on a huge amount of cash. Right. And so they need to do something with that cash. Many are paying back the dividend to the shareholder. Right. Um, is that, that giving out that dividend, raising it, reinstituting it, declaring one. Right. Is that what's going to bring value to a lot of stocks here this year? Um, I think so, and especially in the commodity sector. A lot of their competitors pay the dividend, so they knew they had to bring it back. They had a lot of debt because they acquired a big company during the height of the financial crisis, actually, and they had to um, fund that whole buyout on their own. So they still have about $6 billion in debt on the books, but they're quickly erasing most of that, and then that's why they did bring back the the um, dividends. So yeah, I think a lot of these companies, especially in the commodity sector, if they keep with this kind of cash flow, they're going to be paying it out. Okay. Complete Production Services is another one you've written about recently, CPX, the ticker symbol. Yeah. Uh, they're a driller? Um, no, they're kind of on the, they help the drillers. Okay. Um, they do the production services um, a lot on the horizontal production, which is really popular in the shale. That's where they drill in like horizontally and not oh, okay. down. And that's kind of a specialty kind of technique that they have. And that's, you know, that's the big area now, all these shale plays, the one in Pennsylvania, the couple in Texas and the North Dakota. And, um, you know, they also see revenues really jumping because energy is kind of back in now with crude prices up and more people are going to be drilling in these areas. So um, they also saw 82% revenue growth in this last quarter for their third quarter, mm -hmm. but it was really depressed in 2009. So they're coming off of that now. You can see the estimates are also rising for them. They did move to a number three since I wrote about them last week, strangely, but there's a whole bunch of estimates that were raised just in the last week for the full year this year and next year. So you can see that in the earnings and they're going to get a nice pop. Well, they're expected to have for next year as well um, with this demand for you know drilling that's going on in all these areas in the U.S. Uh, the chart, it looks a lot like tech resources. Um, although it was a little bit uh, lagging a bit until energy really started picking up in the last three or four months. And then the shares took off. They're only trading about 10 times. So it's not real expensive here either. Like these commodity plays have a lot of value. Okay. Do you own either of these two? I do not. Alrighty. Check out more Zach's Rank Buy Stock Picks on our homepage at zax.com. We put four new ones up there for you daily, one in each of the investing categories that we write about. On our website, and Tracy's, the value category is included. With Tracy Reinick, I'm Terry Ruffalo.